me look at the numbers for a second. There's the price that brought you in. Now on this, when I go to the payment, payment matrix, I'm gonna do exactly what you did, but I'm gonna go a lot further telling stories. Chris, I've given you three payment, three down payment options here. Let me tell you what a down payment does for you. Do you want a low payment or a high payment? The lowest. Most people do. The more money you put down, the lower your payment. Do you want to save some money? Yes. The lower the balance to finance, the fewer the finance charges, the more money you save. And the more cash you put down, the quicker you can trade that vehicle. Okay? So keep those things in mind. I'll get back to this in a second. Here I'm going to give you three term choices. This is a short term loan. Saves you a ton of money because you don't borrow the money for as long. It also allows you to trade it sooner and it also gets you to the dream payment faster. You know what the dream payment is, don't you Chris? No payment. No payment at all. However, at 60 months this is a beautiful payment. The payment goes way down. It also provides you financial flexibility because you can pay it off early. There is no prepayment penalty and gain all the same benefits you did here. You just do it in your own time frame. Here's the best of both worlds, okay? Payments lower than it would be here, a little higher than it would be here. Still save money, pay it off quicker, trade sooner. First things first, 2,500, 4,500, or 6,500. Which one of those down payments is gonna work best for you? I can only do 25 a day. I highlight the three payments to choose from, just like Andrew, scratch out the others. High payment, save the most money. Low payment, most financial fle uh, flexibility, best of both worlds. Put a check mark by the one that works best for you. Okay, it right down there. Does this make sense? Yes. How hard is it? I no. Have a question. Yes. So I've, I've done something similar to that before, but I've had customers in the middle of me talking like, I, none of this works, like this is just way out. I, I want it to be. Uh, that, that's gonna happen, of course. Yeah, and so then what's a better response for that? Well, a better response, well, here. Maybe, maybe be on a different plot? Do Well, well no, <laughs> I'm not gonna go there yet. <laughs> stop, stop <laughs> me. You say, oh, these payments are too high. Okay, they're like, yeah, this is too high for me. Okay, not a problem. Everybody says that. Um, as a matter of fact, uh, the payments are higher than they've ever been. You've also picked out the most expensive car you've ever owned, correct? All right. You'll be able to make the payments and you'll quickly get used to them. Now, I need you to pick one and okay that right there. Okay. That, that, that would be my initial response. And if she goes, no, no, you don't get it. I can't make any of these payments. Well, now it's an objection. And I'm going to have to, A, help her come to grips and show her how, the, how she can afford this, and I've got 12 different ways to do it before I ever get to the point where I say, Lori, we're on the wrong vehicle. Because if, in fact, she can't make any of these payments, where was the mistake made? In the fact-finding. In the fact-finding section. And quite frankly, it happens a lot. Okay? Um, if you ask any high paid salesperson in any business what the most important step in the sales process is, what will they tell you? Fact finding. Guess. Fact finding. Because if you land me on the wrong vehicle, wrong vehicle could be one that I don't want or can't afford, it doesn't, nothing else matters. It's all moot after that. Doesn't matter how good a closer you are, doesn't matter how, how well you can handle objections, doesn't matter how good your product knowledge is. If I can't afford it or don't want it, it ain't happening. So that is the single most important step. I don't go down this side at all. Okay? Now this says um, certification fee. Would I have already talked about that? The uh, Family guarantee upgrade to five years. Would I already have talked about that? I'm not going to bring it up again. Now, am I going to be prepared to answer questions? Because they're going to go, now what is this? What is this? 
I'm going to be prepared to answer the questions, but I'm not going to bring it up. I only highlight the positive numbers. In this particular case, the positive number was what the, the price that brought them in. Now, in the deals that you guys present, um, are, there, are there lines for discounts and rebates? I would, by the way, I gave you guys pens with highlighters for a reason, okay? Um, I would highlight any discount, I would highlight any rebate. Tax savings. I would highlight any tax savings. Those are the most positive numbers on any pencil. And again, be prepared to answer any questions. All right, so your doc, your doc fee in Texas, I mean, Texas is a badass state, I get it, but you